Let me at him! Well, there it is. Hello, welcome to a 4 vs 4 random team game on Warcraft 3. Deadlock is our map today. Oh, yeah. And I'm playing as Undead, and I get to have a bit of fun with Undead. I know that doesn't sound right, does it? Yeah, there's something wrong when someone says they get to have fun with Undead. Just it almost sounds like they're lying to you if they say something like that. Well, I'm not lying. Not this time. Every other time, maybe, but not this time. Undead can be fun. And one of the ways to do it is to go goo-goos. So that's what I'm going to be doing. Yes. So let's go to go 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 So we've got our little crypt. We've got our altar and a even smaller cigarettes. That's all you need. Now I'm going to want an expansion. So I've got my pick of the choice. I reckon I'll take this one because I think Pink's going to want that one. Getting an expansion is going to allow me to basically get even more ghouls. And then that might mean another expansion past that point. But we'll see how greedy I get, really. How the game plays out. Nice for you. Yeah, thank you. It is. <laughs> Alrighty, so shall we see who's uh, giving me the strategy for ghouls? I'll let you know in a moment once I get the hero building. Wow. Oh, okay, I'm, I've got the hotkey ready. So, ah, Jigrillo. J I G R I L L O. Jigrillo. Okay. He says, keep the ghoul frenzy. This strategy revolves around maximizing ghoul attack and making them survive as long as possible. Death Knight while maxing out on Holy Order first. Then next the Dreadlord with Vampiric Aura. Get Necros to cast on Holy Frenzy. <laughs> Statues for the heal. Throw in some Banshees for the curse so opponents miss his attacks. Get upgrades and make your ghouls way to ghoul frenzy so they're faster. Reading in a Hispanic accent from the USA if you ever do this. <laughs> I love it when I just sort of make up an accent and start reading. you got to put the um, accent at the start. Put the accent at the start. I, I do love that. Because that's happened on more than one occasion. It's like, I'm reading, I decided to read in a Jamaican accent because you basically said keep D, as in D-E, Ghoul Frenzy. So I was like, oh, he wants the Jamaican vibe with this. <laughs> no, he does not. Well, he might have liked a Jamaican vibe. It's too late to do it again, so submit another strategy. This strategy is probably like four months old, so, you know, that's how far behind I am on strategies, really. It's not so much of a case of being behind, it's just a case of them overflowing to the point where I actually can't keep up with them. But, uh, yeah, let's get a... Yeah, well, no, actually, I'll keep the gold. I don't need it too much. Good for you! Let's move in here. See if we can get the ghouls on that nasty Sorcerer. Yeah, that'll do. And the Death Knight's done enough tanking there. And I can just heal up past that point. Oh, Blue's coming in here for the uh, experience steal. I should just ironically say thanks for the help. Although he might take this seriously. Will you fucking move out of the way so I can take the items before he ninjas them? My patience has ended. My vengeance is yours. My Thanks for the help. This map's kind of nasty for ghouls. Certain spots, anyway. Like uh, this spot would be like a logical spot because they're, they're all kind of green. I should really do the orange spot, his spot. Fuck it, you know. May as well do that. Have some of that action going on. Let's get another necropolis as well. Make it a bit less um, enticing for enemies to attack. Because this is actually going to give me more experience. I'm like, oh, I'll move on to an orange camp and get some experience. It's like, actually, no, this is probably going to give me the most experience thinking about it. Just be careful as soon as the ghouls start getting hit, because they will. Not doing too well for... Oh, there we go. That ninja damage. Oh, 
you're so nasty. I'm not going to save the goal. Oh, I did. Just in the nick of time, but I can't save that one. Yes, I can. Oh, these are hard. Oh, there's fucking Blade Master fucking going for me. On top of that. On top of all the hard work I had to do to keep my goals alive there. Fucking Blade Master. Yeah, well, how legit was that? I let you um, answer that, to be quite frank with you. How legit was that? Freaking teal just turning up conveniently. Not at this base or anything like that, or over here. Where we were, where I was vulnerable. Orc, Blade Master, Map Hack. Kind of goes all in the same vibe. Yeah, I know. I shouldn't accuse. Blah, blah, blah. People are like, oh, you shouldn't accuse. But let's face it, that was pretty fucking suspicious. I'm pretty much expecting him to come in, in my base now. So that's why I'm going to do a patrol route with um, a Nerubian Tower. Unfortunately, that slowed me down a bit now because uh, there's not much I can do whilst I'm waiting and massing up ghouls. Got to get my second hero, the Vampiric Aura dude. Dude, what has the Vampiric Aura going on? Is he actually teched? Yeah, he has teched. But I don't know what he's teching towards. Let's so we're still getting ghouls, still loving ghouls. I should really get myself a graveyard, because that's going to allow myself some nice stuff. I don't know if you need graveyard for ghoul frenzy. You do, actually. But I'm I'm miles away from tier 3 anyway, which is what you need. Oh, Teal spotted my uh, acolyte. Well done there. Very well spotted. There's going to be a lot of sarcasm going on this game, I think. There's not really many strong camps, and I kind of want to do some strong creep camps. I might as well get myself more cool crypts, really, thinking about it. Because, well, that's pretty much what I plan on building this game. I wonder how hard he goes with those headhunters. Because if he goes super hard with those headhunters, then I can have some fun with my ghouls. Because they'll slice through that. Hey, I hit level 2. We're going to get skeletons, but we're going to get them to actually scout. Because we know that he's going to be here, and he would have crept that. So you've got to think about where I can go next before I get screwed. Tech is almost done, so all it means is just more Tekken. More Tekken. Second hero, when I can. Just need a little bit more uh, wood. There we go. That's good. So that's been crept. Green's over here. Time to get the Dreadlord out. That's not a euphemism. Hmm. <laughs> Purple's pushing Teal away. It's a Mountain King though and stuff. I don't feel comfortable taking that on like I want to, but at the same time, if I coil him down a bit, it makes it harder. Yeah, I can go for this. I'll just make it happen. He's not even paying attention. What the hell? <laughs> okay. I'll take some of that experience. That's sweet experience. Thank you very much. I thought I was really worried like he's going to be super good or something. Apparently not. Apparently not. Apparently he's absolutely perfect because that was very easy for me and I got a lot of experience for that. So thank you very, very much for being not what I was expecting. The ghouls are massing, by the way. Ah... Time to punish Teal as well. Revenge. Guess who's coming for you, Teal? Oh, you're starting to change your direction, are you, a little bit there? Oh, that's funny. Come on, Death Knight, keep up. Where'd the Blame Master go? He's worried about me catching him. <laughs> you're so dead. Revenge! We're gonna go Fanpora first with our Blade Master like a proper new Blade Master. Freaking. It's not Blade Master. He's a Dreadlord. That's what he is. A Dreadlord! Okay, Dike. So we've got our Mass Ghouls. We've got that. Got the uh, tech on that. Let's get a couple of statues to boot with it. So we're gonna stay underneath the food cap for a while. Because I don't think we're going to win the game just yet. Oh. I haven't quite got this around here. There we go. 
Oh, it's so hard with goals to actually do anything. <laughs> They're just like, all that hard work. Yeah, you got an awesome surround there, but what does it fucking mean? Just attacks with a couple of units and the ghouls are dead. Get a ghoul frenzy. They might actually attack soon. Human. I could go harass human. I haven't actually got a teleport. Oh. If only I had sleep. I've got to do things the hard way. Very hard way. That's a pretty fast rifle. I'm going to boost up these uh, units a little bit. Now I can get a couple of statues and still trying to stay underneath the food cap if I can help it. My patience has ended. Oh dear, that's your uh, expansion gone. Orange is teleporting back versus this. So I'll get back if I were you. Oh, I just let fucking hero slip by now because I was looking at that. Oh my god, these ghouls are misbehaving. I'm trying to get them to surround and not really playing ball. Okay. <gasps> fucking hate that. It's because it's on the M hotkey. It's really hard to fucking get that hotkey. Oh, that's the problem. You press the M and then it messes up because it is a fucking awkward hotkey. Here's my keys. Here's the M key. I've got to go all the way over and by the time I go over there it gets really messy. No, you're not getting any fucking gold. You already stole experience from me. You got shit. I really need to change that M key. If I change it to G or H, it would be so much easier. H is hold, so I'd change it to G or something. <gasps> Ow! Did he just get out of that? Better not have done. I think he fucking did. That Blade Master is like the jammiest shit ever. Oh, there he is. Think I can't see ya. <laughs> I see you, boy. I see you. Go on, Stormbolt me one more time, baby. There you go, cheeky fella. There's your cheeky Stormbolt. No, I'm not going to get a surround. Of course I'm not going to get a surround. Did some awesome surrounds earlier, but it's never going to happen again now. It's gone. Those days are over. The days of good surrounds are gone. Now is the A move of Dreadlord and Ghouls. And the Death Knight. And I get sleep now. I can actually make my life a bit easier now. May as well pick up a couple of rifle kills for fun. Oh, that didn't last long. That's because he attacked. Clever girl. There we go. Is he going to fit through this tiny gap? No, he doesn't. Not this time. I like it. Oh. Look, he's got mass griffins. Human, what, fast tech and didn't even get himself a freaking expansion to support them. No surprises. There. Okay, what am I missing? Have I got everything? Oh yeah, we're supposed to get um, casters. Alright, well I'll try it. So we'll stay underneath the 80 food cap. How many ghouls have we got? Because we want maybe two groups of ghouls, because it is a lot of ghouls we're focusing on here. Got a couple of statues. Really, you should have like three, if you've got that many ghouls. Because they heal what? Nearby units. It doesn't actually tell you, but I think it's like 12 units it works on. Not all. But then again, those units have to be vulnerable. Yeah, that's enough group. That's two groups of ghouls. If I get any more ghouls, it's just going to be like... A group for like one or two ghouls. It's kind of a, a hassle. So I won't worry about that. That's a good chunk of ghouls. We've got the uh, support heals. We've got Unholy Aura, level 2 at least at the moment. We've got Vamp Aura as well. And some weird ability called Sleep that you should never use as a Dreadlord. You should always go Vampiric Aura first. Always. And please don't always go. <laughs> I'm, just being, I'm just joking, in case you can't detect the sarcasm. Okay, uh, this dude looks like he actually needs some wood. There you go, fella. Have some wood. This guy needs some gold. Fuck off. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's upgrade. This is going to take a while to get to this point. D, 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 not day. Two. Uh, needs a bit of wood. We're in the calm before the storm. Teal's having some fun with blue. But I think blue's going to win that one. Yep. Maybe if you had some awesome micro as an orc, you might be able to do something there, but I think a human's got that one. There's no real reason why the human should lose that, to be honest. 
I could go healing scrolls here, but I don't know. We'll see what my resources are like. Yeah, it does seem like it's kind of warranted, doesn't it? Healing scrolls. Still getting the upgrades. It's not taking too long to upgrade these. I don't have to worry about those until afterwards. So we're going to want Banshees. Uh, do I get Master Banshees? Not really. I only got Banshees like on the Adept level. This guy needs Master. Well, actually, no, he doesn't. But he's getting Master. But I was only really getting Master. Ah, oh, fine, I'll get Master. Because what happens is, is the unit comes out with more mana. When you do it that way. So, eh, I'll just do it. Screw it. This game's going to be over before I do anything. <laughs> oh, they got some counters, though. So maybe not. I don't think my ghouls are looking too strong versus um, what they have. So I better hope my allies don't lose everything. Pink's just joining in now. He's going to get wrecked. He really needs to get out. Back, Pink. Please do not lose your hero, please. You're against, like, three or four... There's no reason for you to stay in there any second longer. This is why I do say that sometimes it's better if you actually start off in a 3 versus 4 when you've got allies that are that bad. But at least he's still able to spam out gyrocopters, which are a counter. Okay. Please get back. Back. Uh, why do I have to tell people what to do? It's not... It's fucking... Oh, well, well whatever. Okay, we gotta go. We gotta go. I can't wait for the rest of these units. This is suicide. This is like all of my hard work pretty much going for fucking nothing here. Do I teleport? I guess I do. Fuck. These guys are so bad. So bad. So very bad. I've not got the scrolls or anything like that. It's a fucking mess. Let's get some skeletons from fucking lols. Schools are actually doing kind of a good job, and bye bye, Blade Master. Ah, oh, no town portal. Look at these ghouls go, they are pretty frenzied up. Give them a bit of credit, they are quite frenzied up. Quite pissed off, quite good to go. And Purple's actually managing to stay alive, and he's got an expansion. Brilliant. So, the other guy that isn't completely useless this game is actually still alive. Brilliant. It's good to see. Still don't have much of a counter to the air. So I can't venture too far. <laughs> Apart from the Banshees, maybe. The restless dead await wow. the dead shall serve better be the dead shall serve. My what? Is this? I've got to get a town portal because they'll just teleport with the frost worms or something. If anything, I should actually try to. Mm. Yeah. I need to try to see if I can sneak on an expansion, but unfortunately, the possible expansions are most likely near. What's his face? Orange. Although Teal's got one down here. So I can have a go on that. Have some fun with this one. Probably siege it down before you can actually teleport over. Ghouls are actually quite relentless. Need a bit more armor on the ghouls. <laughs> Does it look kind of beefy? That is kind of nasty on the ghouls. That's very nasty. Greetings. 
I got the healing scroll though. <laughs> Lightning shield is a pretty strong counter to ghouls. Yes. If I must. Yes. If that is your wish. Maybe a bit more resistant to the frostworms. Blue's getting a few expansions, even though he's out of the game. Could easily get tanks or whatever out of him. It's all up to Pink, best player in the game. It's gone very quiet. They're just hanging out over there. See if I can provoke my allies to coming over. Also got this anti-magic shield dancing around, not doing much. Almost got level six on a drip, Death Knight. If I, if that meant anything, maybe on level three on Holy Aura. Sticking with the strategy, not particularly productive, but. What? Teleport out of that. You could just win walk out of that. Where's that ghoul always out of hotkey range? Gotta be really careful with the blade storm. Not much I can do about that. Well, I'm not looking forward to this to be honest with you, but let's give it a go. Try and unhuddy Frenzy the Griffins a little bit. Trying to put them on not such a suicidal path. Level 3 on the unholy aura. Try to not dive too heavy into that base. This is where it gets ugly. Oh, that's a lot of griffin. Uh, Frostworms. <laughs> this is a fucking mess! Level 3 Pampora! Oh, Blade Master! Oh, did he go down or did he manage to escape just again? I saw the blood. Oh. It's all, it's all going, isn't it? We've got a lot of frenzy and all this fun having in it. I'm seeing things go well for us. Look at those griffins. They're doing a good job. Oh, he's going to kill my death knight. No, he's not, because he's so fucking fast, apparently. GG. And I've slept you. Let's put some anti-magic on you, and then let's see whether you want to attack me again. Yeah, I can dance around in this. I can dance all day. I can dance all day. Just try and hit me. Oh, yeah. Looks like it worked out after all. And everything worked out after all. Do, 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 do. Wait, 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 wait. Let me get him, let me get him, let me get him. Oh, Dreadlord's too slow. He's not going to make it in time. Goals, no! Oh! <laughs> That's what I wanted to do. Yes, that was very tight. But I gave quite an awesome ending right there. Go! Brilliant. Okay, that worked out rather well at the end of the day. I was pretty um, sure that was going to be even. Maybe actually work against us because we were fighting against the base. I just felt like we didn't have that much in terms of dealing with air units. But surprisingly enough, they just kind of got overwhelmed. I think maybe the Necromancers summoning Skeleton Mages and stuff like that probably helped a little bit versus Frostworms. That wasn't even that apparent. I didn't even notice it that much, but I have to assume that was happening quite a lot throughout the fight. Because I had some of them on auto um, necro. So, yeah. Awesome. All right. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. If you did, then like the video. Tap that little like button. That helps out. Uh, subscribe if you want to see more. And share this video with your friends. And if you want to support the channel just a little bit more, you can go to patreon.com slash wittywarcraft. It's in the description. Get yourself access to another video for the month, as well as being on the Patreon credit roll. Yay. All right, then. Thank you very much for watching. Take care of yourselves. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.